colleagues, partners and investors. You're on the channel Dune of Smarters. As usually, I'm Alexander Sudriv and we're on the territory of Sovelmash. Despite the difficult global situation, our work is in full swing. Today we will tell you about the new equipment and these size 132 general purpose industrial motors in the long and short version. Our leading engineer Igor Karhov will tell you about them in more detail. Now let's go and have a look at the new equipment. To my left you can see an industrial dryer cabinet. We needed to optimize labor resources as well as to optimize energy consumption. The dryer cabinet will help us to dry the varnish, impregnated winding of the future electric motors. This procedure has usually been performed in our muffle furnace, but this cabinet, as you can see, has a smaller size, which allows us to significantly save time spent on heating the cabinet itself to achieve the optimal temperature. Among other things, since the process takes much less time, less electric energy is consumed as well. Besides, the second dryer cabinet will allow us to use two motors simultaneously to tackle similar tasks, which will certainly affect the speed of the overall activity. Now I suggest that we move to the laboratory, where Igor Karhoff will tell you why we've got the new general-purpose industrial motors. We have had the new motors delivered. They are size 132 in two versions, with a short and long magnetic core. As always, we want to achieve excellent performance after winding them using the Slavyanka technology. And we will show you later what modifications we have. There are a lot of interesting ideas, but we will share them is a little bit later. In the meanwhile, we're testing a classic motor to see what performance it demonstrates. I can say right away that we can observe a slightly lower performance than the specifications in the motor certificate. But nevertheless, it stands the test. At the end of this video, I would like to ask each of you to hit the like button and the bell icon, and if you haven't subscribed to the channel yet, make sure to do it. There will be a lot of interesting videos for you in the future, informing you about the most important and significant events in the life of the Project Dune of Smarters. That's all I have to say for today. See you in the next program episode.